the first thing that I'm doing with like when I make an R&B type drums is I just start like if I really want to get it right, you gotta like get into it. You gotta you gotta you gotta hammer it down like, like on your cue on your table if possible. You don't have to like bang on it. I mean, it depends on how many people are around. You know what I'm saying? You don't want to look like. I mean, who really cares at the end of the day? You know what I'm saying? Can't be like in a library just like like throwing down like some cold beats and expect people to like feel uh, homely and, and, and okay about that. You know? Anyways. are messes so it's like i wouldn't even consider it a mess at this point i'll just call it a normal video really it's like dude this video is terrible i'm like you should see my other ones do you think this one's bad i don't i don't even look over these after i i, I watch i mean i don't really look i already spent too much time uploading them i spent too much time recording them i got other stuff to do uh but uh yeah i mean you know what i'm saying I don't think we're here for the pattern necessarily. A lot of people just want to figure out like what they can do because everyone has like their own like pattern that they like or vibe or whatever. Uh, I mean, you know, what was I doing? No drums would be complete without the EQ two. What? Deuce is snare. What's this video even about? Christ, mate. <clears throat> uh, what are we doing here? I, got, I might actually have to watch this video because I really have no idea. We got so off topic. Uh. Oh, yeah, that's right. We're doing uh, hip hop. Uh, RB drums. RB drums. That's right. <clears throat> RB drums. A lot of RB drums have that reverb. This one's already on here. Probably from a previous video. Here's it without it. It might sound better in some cases. Yeah, probably sounds better with the reverb in this rare occasion. I think the reverb makes it very like uh very army ish. So there you go. Uh 